Hello beautiful soul, hope all you are doing great and keep yourself balancing. Welcome to my channel Stunning Talks. My name is Infinity and this is Stunning Talks Podcast where we talk about life, love, spirituality, collective energies, the twin flame energy update and divine masculine's current energy and of course the law of attraction. To give you more clarity at last, I share some extra messages from the universe, angels, and even any divine message. For all of you guys, let me tell you that this energy update is timeless. It may not resonate with you right now because we all are on different timelines, but there is a chance that you relate with this after one or two weeks and if you have already experienced everything a few days back, then that's also perfect. So, let's begin today's video when the collective energies are fluctuating one moment, you feel balanced, and on the other moment you go through purging the 7-7 portal. Energies are, of course, in play. We all are entering in a whole new world of higher consciousness. Very important thing here is divine intervention. And when the divine takes charge, nobody can run from their karma. So, both the divine masculines and divine feminines should learn their lesson and follow the divine plan or they have to face triggers or tower moments. This new world or new energies are determined to provide you with whatever you desire, the abundance, the love, the healing, even the union. But if your energies are not aligned with this, you cannot manifest them. And what I mean by that is simply allowing yourself to release all the old beliefs or past blockages you have. As an example, divine feminines have been awakened to this twin flame journey so that they can heal their wounds and blockages in order to awaken the divine masculine. Now, if divine feminines, the chasers still continue with their obsessive behavior towards their divine masculine or be stuck on the 3D material level, then the reunion is not going to happen. Divine masculine and divine feminine, both are one soul and one part the divine feminine part of them has the power to ultimately make the other part, the divine masculine part work. So, it's simply like if one side of your body becomes paralyzed, the entire body cannot move. If the Divine Feminines will not do that work, the Divine Masculines cannot be awakened. Today, I am emphasizing more on Divine Feminines, because I picked up that so many Divine Feminines may hit a tower during this month. This month is going to be heavy. There is also the energy of reunion for many of you, but it is very important that Divine Feminines know what they have learned. Let's clarify Divine Feminines energies. Divine Feminines are of course ascending to higher consciousness and learning to listen to their intuition. As I talked about the Divine Intervention for Divine Feminine's case, some revelations may happen that will force you to think about the situation or make some decisions. I am picking up that you may find out something hidden about your Divine Masculine that will trigger you and detach you from them emotionally. Divine is helping you to see the facts here. Another big reason behind this trigger coming your way is the Divine want you to stop focusing on your Divine Masculine because so many Divine Feminines are still in the chasing behavior and that's why the Divine Masculine's awakening is being delayed as those Divine Feminines are not learning the lessons that Divine is putting them in such situations that will ultimately make them draw that their energy back. I have been telling you guys that it is the time when Divine Masculines are going to release their karmic accounts, but few people said that nothing is happening in their Divine Masculine's life. So, the message is that unless you stop giving your energy to them, or keep on waiting for them to come back, they will continue to run from you. Cutting the energetic cord is very important. Another thing I picked up is that some divine masculines may show up in your life but make sure you invest your energy wisely now let's talk about divine masculine energies in the 3d i can see some actions from divine masculine side maybe a text or call or maybe a proposal is coming in but there is an important thing to notice here you must check whether your divine masculine has learned the lesson or not 
especially observe their actions, because what I am picking up here is some divine masculines are missing your energy as they are handling some pain on their side. They may suddenly get in touch with their own feelings for you and take an impulsive action. So, a reunion is on the way, but I am not going to sugarcoat here, because the energy I'm sensing is that they still have not fully awakened to this connection, and it is not necessary that they come and express their love. That is why I told the Divine Feminines to invest your energy wisely. If you are getting dreams about death or rebirth, or even you are seeing pictures of or news of death or newborns, then it's a sign that you are going through a transformation. And if you are seeing any dreams about, like you are seeing pain of your Divine Masculine in your dreams, then it's a sign that your Divine Masculine's life is going to transform on a big level now. I am sharing three messages from the universe. It will resonate with whom the message is for the first message here is you have all the powers to bring anything you desire in your life and for doing that you need to align with that outcome. Your thoughts, your emotions and actions must be in alignment with your desire. I am picking up that some of you are attracting negative situations again and again because you are creating negative thought. Remember your thoughts create your reality. The second message here is that your light codes are on activation and also you are shedding all the old patterns. You are ascending to a new conscious level. You may notice some changes in your body or your lifestyle or even in your sleeping pattern and your behavior as a sign. The third message here is that some of you are not clear on what you want specifically one moment. You want your divine masculine and another moment you don't as these mixed signals you are sending to the universe and that's why you are manifesting a mixed result in your life. So decide what you want and stick to it in any circumstances. Now the message I got from the angels is that your attitude to a particular situation determines your success or failure. Keep your inner mindset right and optimistic. The message for you is not to lose hope in any situation. And that's it for today's video guys. Hopefully, I have clarified what is happening right now in the collective. If you did like this video, please leave me a comment below and hit like button. Let me know which of these signs resonate with you and I will get back to you. If you are interested in this type of contents, stay tuned for the next video share and please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for any future notifications. I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful, and magical rest of your day and I will talk to you again in the next podcast. Till then take care of yourself, your family, and of course your society also. Thank you for watching.